and Home Alone, still one of the most popular holiday movies decades after its release, Daniel Stern plays one of the bumbling criminals attempting to rob Macaulay Culkin's home. In real life, though, he felt protective of him. As Stern writes in his new memoir Home and Alone, released May 21st, the two spent some time together away from the set. Stern's family was there, too. Macaulay was staying in a different hotel, but we picked him up and took him to the park with us to play, Stern writes. He was a sweet kid but had lived a very different life than my kids. He didn't know how to play tag or throw the ball around. He was more of an indoor kid and had a lot of adult pressure on him from show business and parents and such. Culkin, one of seven siblings aspiring to work in the entertainment business, began acting at four. By the time he played Kevin McAllister, which turned out to be his breakthrough role, he had already appeared on TV a couple of times and in a few movies, including Uncle Buck, which was written and directed by Home Alone writer John Hughes. We realized he had formed a friendship with Michael Jackson because when we picked him up, his hotel room was stacked, literally from wall to wall and ceiling to floor, with toys. Every conceivable toy, as if someone went through Toys R Us, took one of each and dropped them in his room, Stern explains. All a gift from Michael Jackson. It made all of us feel really bad for Mac. My kids had experienced a taste of the distortions that fame can bring but seeing what Mac's life was like put things in a different perspective. A rep for Culkin declined to comment. After Home Alone and its sequel, Home Alone 2, Lost in New York, Culkin went on to do other popular films, including My Girl and Richie Rich. He was also a co-star in Jackson's 1991 video for Black or White, which debuted on primetime TV. In 2005, Culkin testified in Jackson's trial on child molestation charges that the singer had never been inappropriate with him. Jackson was found not guilty on all charges. He has remained close with Jackson's children following his death in 2009. He starred in projects such as Saved, Party Monster, and American Horror Story, double feature in the years since, and has been estranged from his father, Kit Culkin. Stern's post-Marv work has included City Slickers, Very Bad Things, and For All Mankind. The Home Alone family has stayed friendly over the years, with Culkin's McAllister mom, Catherine O'Hara, supporting him in December when he was inducted into the Hollywood Walk of Fame.